The bad king who became a good king. Once upon a time, there was a king who was really very bad. He was always angry with everyone in his palace. He used to beat his servants with a long whip, even for little mistakes. During his morning parade, he beat his poor horse to make him go faster and faster and made his servants run along with him for miles and miles. Even the poor little dog was not spared. The king used to eat a sumptuous dinner. But he did not give even a bone to his poor dog. Not only that, just after his dinner, he would lock up his kitchen and go to bed so that neither his servants nor the dog could get anything to eat. One day, the dog went and said to the horse, Why should we obey this cruel master? The servants said to each other, Why should we serve this cruel master? They could not stand it anymore. When the king was sleeping in his comfortable bed, the servants packed their things and quietly left the palace. Next morning, the king got up and shouted, Bring me my breakfast. But there was no answer. He shouted more angrily, I say, where is my breakfast? But there was no sound in the palace. I am going to teach these lazy bones a lesson today, the king shouted. He took his sword and ran out of his rooms. He ran around the whole palace, but there was no one to greet him. The bad king could not find anyone except his own reflection in a large mirror. Blind with rage, he shouted at his image and said, I will teach you a lesson. With a great crash, his image broke into pieces the king found that he was all alone in his big palace and started crying. What a wretched lonely man I am! He went to his horse and said, Take me to my servants. But the horse could not stand him anymore. The dog said to the horse, Well done my friend, he deserves nothing better than this. Only then did the king realize how everyone hated him. He also realized how cruel he had been. The king bowed down and said, Forgive me, my friends. I was very cruel to you. I will never be the same king again. Please take me to my servants so that I can bring them back and live together happily. The dog showed the way and the horse took the king to the servants. The servants did not know that the bad king had changed. They started running when they saw him coming. The king shouted, Please brothers, listen to me. I did not come to punish you. 
I have come to apologize. He knelt before his servants and said, Please forgive me. From today, I will be a good king and you will all be treated as equals in my palace. The servants were so touched by their master's words that they returned to the palace. Now, the bad king is no more a bad king. In his palace, all are equal and he has thrown away his whip forever.